Hey, Figma just released the most amazing new feature, Figma AI. It allows you to take a prompt, turn it into a design, and we're gonna show you how you can turn that into a full working application easily. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna make a design with AI. We're gonna give it a prompt. So we're gonna create a food delivery application, and we're gonna see it build the screen right here in front of us. And here we go, here comes the screen. It's creating all the menus. We've got different categories for our pizzas. Uh, we've got different restaurants over there, some sample content. Um, it's actually gonna create all the images. How cool is this? How much time is this gonna save? Now we can make some simple tweaks, and once we're ready to go, then we're ready to mark it up with the Buzzy plugin and make it work. Cool. So now once we've got our initial designs at Figma, and in this example, we've got two screens, we can now use the Buzzy plugin to mark it up. We will have a new auto markup feature that will do this in seconds. For now, it took about 30 minutes to do this on these applications. But what we used over here was the Buzzy um, plugin. We defined the data model, and then we went into the design, and we could do things like mark up our screens fields, dynamic lists of items. So for example, over here, this is the Joe's Pizza field. Um, that's going to be used, and that's going to map to the database item, which is the restaurant name. So that's it. Once you're ready to publish that application, you can then turn it into something that works. Let's have a look at um, this application. So here it is. Um, so here's the app. It's running as a web app over here, but you can also have it as a native app in iOS or Android. Um, this is all running off real data. So if we clicked into, let's say, Joe's Pizza over here, we see the menu items. Now to give you a quick look, inside the Buzzy workspace, we have a set of data tables that have all things like the restaurants and the relationships between each re restaurant and a set of dishes. Um, and if again, if we looked at, uh, for example, over here, we got the meat lovers one, Let's change the meat lovers one to something that's vegan. Let's pretend that this is all plant-based and we can change it to herbivore's dream. We flick back over here, we'll see that it's already changed the herbivore's dream. So the next step would involve then creating the screens and hooking up things for things like orders and checkout, delivery, and so on. Again, turning it straight from Figma, um, from the design file into a working application is really easy using the Buzzy plugin and again, serving both web and native. It's absolutely awesome. How exciting is that? Early days, super excited. Go check out our blog article. We've got some cool hints and tips in there and looking forward to what you've got to say about this and what you can build. See you later.